Listen, what do you, what, what can you, t do you know future? Who, do you know who this future guy is and who he's connected uh, no to? No idea. Okay, okay. Say wow. That. So what's going on with that? Some guy, future comes by the showroom one day talking like big that he's got a few hundred thousand dollars that he wants to outfit his entire house. Okay. But he don't want to design it. He's looking for a designer. Now, at the time, he said that he was willing to pay 30% of the cost of materials just to the designer. So if it's like 100K in furniture, he would pay 100K for the furniture and 30K for the designer. So we talked about it with our crew and he said he was good for it. You know, he had a lot of money. We said, it's a big sale. Let's cut this guy a good deal. Okay. We convinced our designer to do it. She begrudgingly accepts because it's a lot of work. And we fill this guy's house with like 80, 90, almost 100K worth of furniture. But you fill, a, what, do, what do you mean by fill this house? Hold on. Based off of a $15 initial down payment. $15? One $5? No, $15,000. Oh, $15,000. Okay. Yeah. So he puts 15000 down. I figure he's good for it. We fill up his house. When it's all done, I quote him sixty five k brother. Like, I mean, we cut this guy such a deal because we assumed the whole second floor we're going to do too. All right. I'll pay it right away. One day passes nothing. Two day passes nothing. Three day passes nothing. <laughs> Four day passes nothing. Jesus from Christ, Jack. And I hear that this whole someone in his crew is like laughing about good luck getting paid. So I call up Diva. I said, come on, let's go. We're repoing all the furniture. So we go in there and we take every piece of furniture that we put in back out. And this asshole wakes up and he's pressed about it. Oh, so, you so, he get, comes so you got your shit back at least. Yeah, 100%. Okay, then you're sorry. 100%. So, you know, we talked it over with, I talked it over with Devon and Devon was like, you know, brother, look, this guy wants his 15K back because we swiped everything. And let's just, let's just pay him back. I'll, I'll do it. I say whatever. If you want to do it Don't that way. We already, no, exactly. We're beefing with Hydra. There's this whole other crew now that wants some smoke. Oh, so I go to this. So I go sorry. to this meeting with this future guy and he's rolling with the with the dickhead forehead, butthead. It, it's a bunch of heads in this crew. So they come up and it's the first time I'm going to see this asshole after he told me he's going to pay and he never paid. And the attitude that he came at me with, Lang, I didn't like and accept. So now he's not getting anything. That's kind of the vibe I was going with. Good. So they've been coming around the house the past few days, you know, since then, shitting on our porch, attacking our people. You know, there, there was like two, three shootouts just yesterday on our on our home turf. Jesus. Our, yeah, so it's been kind of hectic. Okay. Um, hey. I mean, let's see, you got your shit back. That's all that matters. Yeah, we got our shit back, but, you know, it's it's been expensive. Um, 